Go ahead, please. My name is Raynard Jackson. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you, Daryl, for inviting us to this round table here. I'm from St. Louis originally, live here in, in Virginia. But what I'd like to say to you, Mr. President, is kind of off the beaten path. I'd like to say to all the media <laughs> assembled here that I wish they would quit lying about what you've done specifically for the black community. So you got radical liberal journalists like Joy Reid from MSNBC, Don Lemon from CNN, Roland Martin, who are putting more poison into the black community than any drug dealer, who are killing more black folks than any white person with a seat over their face. How are they doing it? Spreading these lies about the economy you had, Mr. President, before the virus was a continuation of Obama. That's that's factually not true. I have a degree in accounting. I keep up with the economy. They're lying. So to all these folks on MSNBC, CNN, Roman March, what are you afraid to have real black Republicans who know what the hell they're talking about? If you want to know the truth, if you want us to dissect the Obama economy, let's do it. And I think, Mr. President, your record would win the debate. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much. And you know, it's interesting you say that, but you go down a list of criminal justice reform and, and all of the things we've done, opportunity zones, the best unemployment rate in the history, just before the plague came in. Uh, and it's going to be back again soon. I think it's going to be back again a lot sooner than people think. I think last week was a reflection of that, the uh, jobs numbers. But you look at all of the things we've done. Uh, we've now worked on pri uh, prison reform, so important, and so many other things. Uh, uh, but when you look at the economics, when you look at how well the black community has been doing under this administration, nobody's done anything like we've done.